Okay. Good. Okay, there we are. So, welcome all of you to this K-Plin session, in which we are going to see some other things we have never talked about in detail, yeah? And the idea is that we exercise certain aspects of composing straight away, okay? I have here a couple of exercises for you, so we will try and go straight away to it. So, very good. So, let's see, just to keep a, a bit of a track on what's going on here. That's it. Okay. It's exactly this what I want to see. Yeah, continuation, consequent, contrasting idea replaced by continuation phrase. Yeah, so we're going to listen to this example. The 526. Are you ready? <laughs> If you were dealing with, uh, ah, sorry, I haven't been sharing the screen, right? I will share the screen now. That's it. Okay. I will share the other screen. That's it. And that's it. And then she said, Perfect. Good. Georgios, if you've been working on the analysis of the sonata that you have assigned, yeah, you've seen probably a lot of these in Haydn, a lot of extensions, yeah? Mm -hmm. So I will just yes. the WhatsApp. So, of expansions in this case, it's an expansion. Can you, see, can you see why it's an expansion? And not an extension because not an extension exactly because it uses the same elements. Mm. It's an expansion. Well, I will tell you why it's called an expansion. So, if it was an extension and it was a consequent, you should still have a basic idea and a contrasting idea, right? And somehow we should be extending the contrasting idea, yeah but still it should be an idea, right? But in this case, it behaves like a continuation, mm -hmm. not as a contrasting idea. Why? Because we have a fragmentation, yeah? And we have a model with sequence. And then we have a cadence. Oh, so, yes. Yeah? It, so so oh, if yes. you isolate this, yeah? It's a continuation phrase, actually, mm. rather than anything else, okay? Now, this makes a lot of sense, because, remember when Iris brought it up to the lesson that said, oh, which are the things in common between, what has things in common, no? Which things have, which um, yes, phrase yes. function types have things in common? Well, the continuation mm. and, the co and the contrasting idea. Well, here you see how we can actually replace the contrasting idea with a continuation phrase. But, as you can see here, this serves as an example to demonstrate that it's not the same, a continuation and a contrasting idea. Yeah? We have many things in common, but it's not the same. Okay? So we will analyze it once again. Okay? So we will, sorry, we will listen to it once again. <laughs> Well, I, I, I mean, I don't feel like, uh, of course, there's no contrasting idea, so it's just super smooth. I just, it yes. just continues the same thing, right? It's the same. It's the same thing, but in terms, it's good. It's true. It's true. Exactly. That's the that's the the, the objective of the device to make it smooth. Yeah. So it doesn't. 
kind of uh, shock the listener. But at the same time, something happens with the balance. It's longer. It's yes, less. and it feels irregular, mm. doesn't it? It defies your expect your rhythmic expectation. Yeah, the resolution doesn't come where it should be. Yeah, we will listen to it again. <laughs> In terms of the whys and the what's, yeah, Hayden is not going to do just... Hayden is it's not very capricious, Hayden, no? Hayden in general is quite formal, yeah, in, in, in its syntaxes, but he always finds a way to scholastically challenge the norm, yeah? Who can tell me what is the tool, the pivot, the syntactic pivot, the decision that he made yeah, in terms of harmony in terms of harmony I will help you a bit because I want so in terms of harmony, what is giving him the pivot to alter the syntaxis? He has to modulate back Why? He's modulating to the, it's a sequential Eso, that's it, well done, well done that's it, it's, that's the effect of a sequential basic idea in a period, yeah? It leaves you on a quite wrong position, yeah? That's why, yeah, the basic idea in sequence is normally used in the sentence. sentence. Remember, because we, for some reason, yeah, we, we have, uh, it's somehow easier, yeah, to get where we have to be. But in here, it really puts us in a, in a not spot. Yeah. So we need to alter, uh, we need to alter the, the structure of of the theme itself. Yeah. So that's the reason. And Anna, mm -hmm. can you give us just we sing it a bit? No? So ping pam, piri da da da, piri da da da, ram pam, piri da da da. Can you just close this one for us? Without the expansion, just thinking. Mm -hmm. So, so from the beginning to the end. Yeah, just give me the theme without bum, the, the phrase deviation. Okay, so I will do. Bum, ba, da, 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 ba, da, 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 yeah. yeah, I will just go with the mood. Also. Continue the movement. Yeah, let me see what's the tonality. Yeah, something. I will continue with that. Yeah, for example. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So the key is continuing with the uh, texture of the melody and the melodic line. Huh? Exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What happens when I try to do that due to the modulation? Can you spot it? What I'm struggling to to do? Ah, right, can you can you do again? Yes. Please? How is the piece? Now I managed to do it better. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I have no other choice but to make uh, some leaps. Yeah. And somehow, yeah, I don't have enough space. Yeah. It sounds awkward. The coming back it from It sounds this abruptly stopped. No? It sounds unrefined. You have to go from... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's all right, yeah, but mm -hmm. yeah, it doesn't kind of... So what, what he did, yeah, is to give purpose to the sequence. He says, so 
the sequence sounds like an accident. It sounds like a preparation for something more elaborate, which is the, the modern mm -hmm. sequence, yeah, that comes afterwards as well. So yeah. So it gives more it repurposes the, the choice of, of the sequence in a way. Yeah. So okay. Good. It is. Uh, we do a compound basic idea, can you? In four by four. Uh, okay. So I give, you the, I give you the, the key. C major. Yeah. Yeah. Then okay. don't make oh, like a huge, yeah, uh, big register piece. Just small. Uh, let's try to obey this more or less the same rules. So do to sol maximum. Yeah? Do to sol. Okay. Many, yeah. And in four by four. Yeah, and also how many different rhythms, uh, note values we can. He used two, three note values, quavers, minims, and crochets. Yeah, and also, yeah, something very stepwise. Uh, no, not a lot of leaves. We can use one or two leaves, but not too many. So we we'll review four by four, only three note values. Yeah, from Do to Sol, the opening. Okay. Uh, okay, so. <clears throat> Dum Pam 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 So one more time, Georgios, let's see if you can remember it. Well, she, Iris did it tetic the second time, so pim pam pam no, pim pam pam and then she did tam So basic idea is an acrusic and the, the other one is static. Yeah, so pim pam 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 Okay. Anna, can you sing it? Anna, can you sing it? Okay. So, Iris, can you do it again? Uh, yes. Um, dum, dum, da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Very good. Thank you. Okay. Now we have to sequence it up. No? So, Wait. Anna, we have to sequence it up, so we will replicate this. So, Anna, are you there? We can't hear you, Anna. I don't know if she can hear us. Do you hear her? No, I don't know, maybe she, she's having some trouble or something. Okay. Georgios, can you just sequence it up, please? To the second. Hmm. In minor. Hmm. In minor? I, no, no, no. It's in, in minor, was it? Yeah, it's in minor. Well, you don't need to sequence it if you don't can want I to. Play it? Yeah. <laughs> up to you. Okay, let's see. But sequence it up. Yeah, so, so basically transpose it one tone up. Can I play instead of sync? Yes, of course you can. Yeah. Do, do, re, mi, re, do, sol. And then she did. 
re, mi, fa, mi, re, do, si. Ah, and then in second. No. Re, re, mi, fa, mi, re, do. No? But is the good connection. It's a sequence, here, it will be rough anyway. This one here he do the first to make sure that he can do a sequence. Again, sorry? This example he finishes on the tonic, so then he can go to the second. But if we finish on the dominant. Yeah, that's true. No, 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 Yeah, you can still do it, you can still do it. Eso. Well, it's good. I only ask you to sequence it, right? So now I will ask Anna, now that we can, I think Anna is better now. Anna! Now you know what happened, you, you ended with the most difficult thing. <laughs> so <laughs> yeah. now, now you have to do the model sequence to bring it back to the tonic. Yeah? So Georgios, just play it again for Anna up to the point where we you left it, yeah, and Anna finishes it with the model sequence. Okay? No. Re mi fa mi re do. And now I know. Okay, so can you play me, once? Uh, play it once. Play it once. Yeah. Do you exactly mean by the multiple? Do, do. Yeah, basically Check. what you need to do is we, we we are replicating the same thing. So basically you have do do uh. re mi re do sol and then Re mi fa mi re do si. Yeah, and then Re mi fa mi re do. Yeah, and then you need to do the rest. Wait, sorry, so I'm a bit lost. So it's just got the same structure as the melody as the other ones? Or? Yeah, basically, you need to replicate the recipe. So uh, what she, what uh, Beethoven, oh. Beethoven, I think it is. No, it's not Beethoven, it's Hayden. No, no, no. What Hayden did is, um, mm -hmm. Hayden did like a fragmentation through model sequencing of a tweaked pattern from before. Yeah. So we, I expect you to do the same. So a, a, a little fragment. Yeah. So you reduce, uh, you reduce the, the intervening section from two bars to one bar, you base this reduction, you pick it up from what happened before, and then you start modulating and sequencing, you do the dominant of the dominant until you reach a point in which you do a cadence, yeah, and you do a perfect authentic cadence. Okay, <laughs> uh, well, Yeah, it sounds too uh, when I say it, but actually it's easy to do. Yeah, it's just, it's just need to do it. Holy, okay. I got a big old brain price, but okay, I'm gonna try. So I will just a monthly, so... Uh, yeah, basically, I can do it. Yeah, so... And then... What we have? Pa, ta, ka, ta, ka, ta... Yeah, the problem is that... Let me see something again. Yeah, the problem is that in Iris's theme, we have a semi brief mm -hmm. in the second part of the of the basic idea. Yeah, so we can do a lot with the, that semi brief. Yeah, it's not something like here that we can still recover. Yeah, so I think we will have to pick up something from the beginning. So look. Pam pam pa 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 pam, and then I will do. Sorry. No. Sorry. Re mi fa sol do re mi fa. We need two bars more, but the sequence should be there. Yeah. So. 
Yeah, no worries. I will do it. it's, it's too difficult. So we'll do this one myself. So listen to me. Again. Mm. Bum. So do, re, mi, re, do, sol. And then re, mi, fa, mi, re, do, si. Then sequence up. Re, mi, fa, mi, re, do. And then re, mi, fa, sol, do, re, mi, fa. And now I need a perfect authentic case. So I jump to la instead. La, si, do, re. And then do si la si do yeah pa pa bi pa pri da 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 yeah pa 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 pi pa 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 pri pa no actually I could have done re mi fa sol do re re I think I over minimize it let me say once again re mi fa re mi re mi fa mi re do re mi fa mi re Re mi fa sol do re mi fa la si do re do si la si do. I commit a mistake with the tempo. Yeah, so that's it. I have to just stop me. Okay. So who can des describe what I've done now that you well? A sequence in a in, a, in an expanded actually a fragment from before. Exactly. So somehow, yeah, we managed to kind of replicate this. What I want you to do today, each one of you, is to replicate this, yeah, as I've done it, okay, with the ear. And then, mm -hmm. okay, so we start again. Okay, now we understand what I've done or not. Iris? Yes. Yeah, because today you're silent, so I don't know. So it, it, you, you got it, no? Sure, 100%? Okay. Anna? Anna? Anna. Sorry, can you miss sorry? I just muted the uh, yes, almost almost on your time. The model sequencing I still uh, I don't get it that much, but I understand the first part is basically a counter saying continuation, but the model thing is just the things we get in random stage, so Okay. We can't hear you super well, but I think I understood you. Okay, mm. so what you think is that you don't mm. understand very well what you do in the second half. Okay. Mm. Okay, very good. So, okay. So what I've done is, I will go to the second half. So, re, mi, fa, mi, re, do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If now I I thought and I can do it even more similar to this. So we can do when when I get re mi fa mi re do and I could do re mi fa mi re do re mi re do la si do si do re do for example la si do la si do re do si do re mi re do yeah. And then I would be doing exactly the the, fact, the the same motif there. So, re, mi, fa, mi, re, do, un, tan, tan, re, mi, fa, mi, re, do, re, mi, re, do, si, do, re, do, si, la, si, do, si, do, re, do, for example. Yeah? That would be even more similar to the same recipe that we have there. Yeah? Basically, I picked up the model, yeah, as a model, the first half of the basic idea exactly as it was rhythmically yeah and i sequence it down yeah to create an asymmetric consequent because it's basically mm. a plus continuation yeah and it return yeah to a cadential situation in the end similar to what we have written here. okay so my my idea is that you the three of you together you can catch from each other yeah and get this done okay mm -hmm. So another thing, another thing. Try to keep it simple, the thing, because you see, otherwise we struggle. Yeah. So try to keep it nicely cut. So I receive the first thing, Anna does the second thing. Just 
Basic idea, Anna, that's all. A basic idea. Uh, sorry, I need to tell you. Sorry, I need to tell you. I need to tell you we do it in 3 by 4 Yeah, we do it in 3 by 4 We do it tetic. Yeah, so we start on, on the beat. So 3 by 4 you start on the beat, crochets and minims. Nothing else, step by motion. Sorry? Do mayor. Do, yes. Yes. <laughs> yeah. We we hear very badly. Anna, are you sure you're on the cable? Yes, my laptop and the phone both is battery is not busy since 8 a.m. in lesson. So, okay. Ah. Uh. Okay, well, don't worry, they, they leave it there. So we, we, we just continue with, uh, then, I, then I call you and we try to sort it out. So, Iris, can you do the thing? No, no, you already did the thing, Iris. So, Georgios, can you do the thing? Battery. The battery is low. Okay. That's fine. So, okay, Georgios, can you do the thing, please? Basic idea. Yeah, basic idea. Mm. Don't skip, don't skip. I thought so. Okay. But then I don't want to go to <laughs> I, I don't know how you do it, but so don't skip so much. Okay, just skip a bit less. You know, if you want to skip, just do a third maximum of skip. Okay? I did just a third then. No, but you didn't cover the gap. That's why it sounded boy. Yeah, so. But, do, re, mi, mi, sol, fa. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. Just. So, do, re, mi, mi, sol, fa. That's fine. Yeah. Do, re, mi, mi, sol, fa. Iris, the contrasting idea. Okay. Um. It has to be in one note. Let's see if you catch it. It's set up to be in one note that contrast. Uh, yes, that's yes, that's one. Well, I don't know if it's the same, but. So you did. Sorry, I'll just hear. Too, dif too difficult, too, too different. Oh, Do, re, mi, mi, sol, fa, and then. Um, what 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 note is, is almost uh, there? It's, it's, it's sounding already. I don't know. Okay, okay. No. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, so I'll repeat it again. Georgios is hearing as well, the same note I'm hearing, I think. <laughs> <laughs> really? Am I the only one that are not? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> so, really? Georgios, which one is that now? I would play me. It's like... Yeah, me is one, and also re. Mm. Yeah, because... I played me too much. You, exactly, because remember, when you, when you incorporate a new element like a skip, you have mm. to make it sound like it wasn't an accident. So yes. the first thing you need to try and um, use it again, yeah. So then it's you you and uh, reinforce the idea of the of the skip, yeah. So for example, now what happened is that my contrasting idea is not very contrasting. You could have that. So no 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 or something like that, yeah? So, Iris, it's your turn, so you will do the contrasting idea. So let's see. Okay, so not ease because it's too repeated. Yeah. Do, re, mi, mi, sol, fa. 
Okay. And then you can do me again if you want this time, but then you need to do at least you need to do the skip. Yeah. If you okay. Want. No, too much, right? Okay, I'll try again, okay? Um, So mi fa sol big skip, do re. But this is if you were doing, yeah. So no 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 no. It works like kind of a mirror, for example. Yeah. So that's fine. We we, we leave that one. Do re mi mi sol fa mi fa sol si do re. And now Iris sequence it. So, okay. But okay. finish on the re. Sorry? Finishing on the re. Yeah, it's difficult. Starting on the re. Yeah. Okay. Um, well, we can, I, I okay. will finish it on a different place. So. No, but you, we need to finish it there, otherwise it doesn't work with the skin. Yeah, okay. It's like uh, a puzzle. I mean, you take it out from one side and then you, you can fit it from the other one. Okay. Or, or change the contrasting idea. Change the contrasting idea. Change it. Don't right. use my contrasting idea. Use <laughs> another one. Use another one. Yeah. So, I do now the contrasting idea, yes, right? Yes, yes. I'm finishing okay. the imperfect cadence like the example. Yeah, in a let's finish it on imperfect cadence. Why not? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so not half cadence. No. Yeah, let's do it exactly because it has to be a compound basic idea. So we need to finish on actually on tonic prolongation. Yeah, true. Okay. Uh, okay. And why so I it was... that? Why I started doing a half cadence? I don't know why I started doing a half cadence. Someone did a half cadence. I've... Okay, that's fine. I don't know. Maybe I maybe I did before. Yeah, I don't I know. know. I, I do a lot of half cadence. Okay, don't do a half cadence. It's totally prolongation. It's okay, okay. Basic idea. Uh, okay. Um... I don't know. No. I was going to do half cadence mm. again. Wait, wait. Um... Too many gaps. Okay, let me see. The thing is, no, oh what you, need to, to, you need to think about is similar to what we did last lesson in compo when we're doing it without the pitches. Yeah? You need pa ra ra ri ra ra ta ra ra ri ra ra. Yeah? No, ta ra. It doesn't need to. It's more like no. Well, if you do this, the sol, and then yeah, you need to mirror it so you finish in the tonic again. So. Something like that, but I mean, you need to, to keep the harmony in, in, in your mind. If you need to finish in the tonic, it needs to be, for example, tonic, dominant, dominant, tonic. For example, can you know, you that's true. Okay. Okay, so.
For example, sequence yes yes you do everything do that then, then do it more, more sequence and then what it's easy this one to do more sequence actually yeah Just be less creative and imitate more Hayden, and it will be, it's, it's, it's almost there. If you just do what Hayden did, it's almost there. So let's analyze this example a bit more. So we, we try to, to do it more like him. So he did, look, he did. He went to the minor, no? Yeah, he did it non-diatonic, he did like completely modulatory. So why don't we sequence it so it's also modulatory, can you? Mm. So your, your basic idea. Yeah, just sequence it so it is modulatory. Yeah. Yeah, it's almost the same as he did. Yeah, it's almost the same. Because of the because of the tail of your of your basic idea. It's very similar to this one. So it's pararatariran, tarararirarun, then tarunun, tarunun, You could have done even the same as, as, as Hayden did. What are you using there? I'm copying, I've, I've done pa 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 piran, tom piran, tom piran, yeah, Mm -hmm. Yeah, automatic. The same as he did. He did. Yeah, so he did the fifth of the second. Yeah, and then he did the fifth of the fifth. So pa pi pa pra pi pam pa da dum dum dum. Yeah. Yeah, just to do it almost the same way. Okay, well, we continue. Anna, do you think, because I, I, I'm not feeling well, not, not participating you at all, can you go closer, I'm... can't you go closer to the router and you sing? Yes, it's not the router, the problem is the battery. What battery? The phone battery. I've been since 9 a.m. on But what does it have to do the phone battery with the router? 
es que no hay internet, la batería es un 9%, es muy low. So, ¿Qué tiene que ver? No entiendo nada. Uh, Estoy más perdido que Tour con la neblina, como se dice. ¿Qué, qué tiene que ver el, uh, el teléfono con la Biblia? No entiendo qué tiene que ver el teléfono con el... Con, con... ¿Qué tiene que ver el router con el teléfono? Es que no es el problema el router, es que como tengo batería baja, el sistema interno funciona malito, pues ya 2%. Ah, ¿y por qué no pones la computadora? Igual, sí, la computadora igual, y supuestamente estoy dentro, pero... Pero es que estoy ya no, no de por qué, de la compu. I'm letting it charge a little bit. Ah. Super. Yeah, no sé. I've been super okay. working and not stop on class, so the whole battery is super low. Ok, ok. I'm puzzled. Uh, so, let's see. Um, I will go to the next... Um... I will go to the next example, ok? So, let's see. I will explain you a bit more because I think I'm going too fast. So, I will, I will explain you a bit more. Yeah, I have. There is a very famous phrase that Gisela can share with you then of a, a teacher that we used to have, singing teacher, that explains something to a student, the student doesn't understand anything. Um, and then she said, you have the expression of someone who has an information overload. And it's exactly what I am kind of seeing here. So we're going to go a bit back and see if I can go a bit. Uh, where am I? Okay. Tend to be one or two measures in length. Okay, so let's do a bit of codetas. What's the difference between a cadence and a codeta? What do you think? To what I saw in the Kepler, Codeta is an element used in a, not, a, not what we say Coda. I would say Codeta is a big cadence, but I think uh, no. Kepler is the element of a big, of a expanded cadence. Ex kind of thing. So we basically, Ex mm, a cadence fun. has all the chords of a cadence, right? A Codeta can have it too. You can have two ECPs, one after the other, yeah? So you could still have two cadences, and one is the codeta, and the other one is the real cadence. That could happen as well. But most normally, the codeta is, uh, is prolongational. Yeah, it's prolongational on the, on the tonic. Yeah? No. Not expansion. Sorry? Is not expansion? No, it's... The codeta, no, because it, it can... It can no no let, but let me see why not in a clear way because the codeta opens a new element yeah mm. it's it's a something else it's like a um an elaboration of, of a cadence it happens it's a post cadential deviation is called it's a post cadential devi deviation the cadence is there and then we have something happening after the cadence we open a new territory Yeah, something that if you, if you had an expansion, you don't open a new territory. Yeah, you are replacing. Like for example, let's go to the to this uh, example we just been in. He replaced the contrasting idea with a continuation that is longer, right? So it's an expanded, but it's not an expanded contrasting idea. It's an expanded consequent. The consequent that has to have basic idea plus contrasting idea has basic idea plus continuation. So he but this expanded contrasting idea. It's not an expanded contrasting idea. It's an expanded consequent, what we just did. But, but why? It's, a, it's the same as the contrasting idea and the speaker. No, because the contrasting idea... Has the same elements, no? Mm, they share the same elements, but in the continuation... I, I mentioned the reason. Let me see if I can remember it now. Yes. The contrasting idea should have 
something new, contrasting to the basic idea. But in the case of the continuation, the continuation elaborates over something that had from before, right? Mm -hmm. And also, yes, yeah, and also, um, no, I think that is the most. There must be something else, but that that's the most important thing. Yeah, it's not eminently contrasting the continuation. It doesn't have to be necessarily. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So while the contrasting idea needs to be contrasting with the with the with the basic idea. Yeah. Now he expanded the consequence the consequence by means of replacing the contrasting idea with a continuation. And we said, this is a great example to mention that the continuation is similar to the contrasting idea. They share a lot of features, but it's not the same. That otherwise, we would have called it contrasting idea or something else. Yeah? So, that's the way. Yeah, that, that's, that's, the, that's an expansion. That's an expansion. We realized the Cadeta, the Codeta, the, that what happens in the end as a big, that's the big tonic. So, last, like the last tonic is expanded, but I guess the terminology wouldn't work here. Yeah, and there is there are particularities about the codetas which are not in the in the extensions. For example, mm -hmm. the codeta has to be a post cadet. It's called codeta if it happens in a post cadential positioning as well. That also mm -hmm. defines the name of codeta. On top of that, in general, it's tonic prolongation. In general, it might not, but in general, it's tonic prolongation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we could argue that even if it's, it ha, it's double cadential, as it can be double cadential, yeah, the overall effect is tonic prolongational, because at the end we are finishing in tonic anyway. Yeah, we are not. We can with the codeta we can modulate somewhere else. Mm -hmm. Also, the codeta can't open a new dimension of melodic syntaxis. The codeta is always diluting, yeah. While in the continuation, an extension does the opposite. Yeah, tries to push forward. Yeah, towards a so the codeta push inwards. Yeah, the, it, let's let's continue with the same analogy. Sorry, the same antagonism. Yeah, the in the extension in the in the continuation pushes, so then we reach the cadence. The codeta implodes, so actually finishes with music. It doesn't yes. ignite another element. Mm -hmm. Can you? Re are, is it clear? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. So let's listen to this example then of a codeta. Also, the codeta is inside something that we call the closing section. Yeah, that involves the codas and the codetas. Yeah, and the codeta normally works on liquidation. Yeah, so it becomes smaller and smaller. Yes. That's the term I was looking for. The closing yeah, the section, closing. yeah. Yeah, the closing section. That, that's actually the... Yeah, we are talking about codetas inside a closing section. Yeah. Something I didn't say, which also aids to the confusion. So, let me just see if I can go to the beginning of closing section. Yeah. I think I've seen codeta being used as a closing section. Yes. Like, no, one term. codeta, only one codeta. No. The term, not, not in Kaplan, the term codeta to be used for a bit, for for four bars of yes, a closing section. Yes, 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 it's true. Yeah, when we are playing an instrument, we normally call codeta a small coda. It's a codeta. Yeah, yeah. it's actually, yeah. So let's go to the easiest example first. So we go to this one. Yeah, the 516. And I stop there because there is a cadence. The cadence is already there. Yeah? And this sonata, do you find it familiar, Giorgio? No, but I was very surprised. I'm worried then if you don't find it familiar, this sonata. Ah, I haven't gone there. Ah, that's it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so. Let's go again. Let's go again. Yeah, it's the third movement of your sonata. I could have finished there. But then... Beautifully diluted. Beautifully. 
tutti i flidai lutit, ya? Pam pa piri pi pam pa piri pi pam pi pam pi piram, ya? That's by book. Sorry, Gorgas? Liquidation. Liquidation, exactly. An ontonic prolongation, ya? Yeah? So now I will give you a theme and you will do a codetas, ya? Yeah? All of you, okay? So let me see if I can give you a thing. I will put together a thing now. Yeah? So from there. So the second. So, who wants to start? Tony prolongation, so easy, no complications, just I want two codetas, two bigger codetas, two smaller codetas, and finish. Iris. Do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, si, la, sol, fa, mi, re. Okay. Do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, si, la, sol, fa, sol, mi. Can you repeat? Yeah. Do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, si, la, sol, fa, sol, mi. So, I will okay. give you a recipe, I will give you a recipe. You need to catch, you need to catch an element, yeah? So, okay. I'm giving you several, so, that's one, and then you have, and then I have, and then it's a sequence of that, uh, sorry, uh, Yes, a sequence of that. So you have two rhythms. And then... So pick one of your choice. Okay. Perfect. Uh, okay, so... What is the theme again? Do, do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, si, la, sol, fa, sol, mi. Too short. Yeah. Oh, man. I don't know what to use. For example, look, if you use the same recipe as Mozart, so do re mi fa sol la si la sol fa sol mi fa sol la si la fa sol sol la si la fa sol la si sol la si sol. Yeah, the same recipe. Yeah, because he did. A compound thing, so the, the last no, because I have pam, 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 and then I have pira pa pira pa para pam, so I get that pira pa para pam, and then I do para pa pira pam, so the same no para pa pira pa para pa pira pam, and then I need one na 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 na, na, na for example para pa pira pa para na 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 pa pa. That would be uh, the same recipe. Yeah. Mm. Now I will give you a different thing. Yeah, to the one I just had. So let me see if I can give you another one. See? So in minor, so I don't do the same. And tan 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 tan. No, 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 no. I need to go to the end only. La si do re mi fa mi re do do si la. Yeah? Now, post cadencia. So, first of all, how many things I use? La si, la si do re mi fa, la si do re mi fa. 
And then mi re do do si ma mi re do do si and mi re do ta 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 is the end and the beginning ta pa 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 so we have negra con puntillo you have crochet with dot dot crochet ta pa pi ra ri ra dot crochet followed by four quavers that's the the rhythmical structure you can use from the beginning of the yeah and then you have meaning with four crochet four quavers Meaning with four quavers. Meaning with four quavers. In the end, crochet to quavers, crochet, crochet. That's what you have in the end. Crochet to quavers, crochet, crochet. And in the beginning, you have dotted crochet. So you have dotted crochet and five quavers. But you got to be. You can do whatever you like, Jorge, eh? but just to. making you think. from before and you put something together yeah I will not let you go until, <laughs> until you actually do it <laughs> so Georgios and you do the theme and you do the codeta let's see if it works better so it's not a theme yeah it's like a like a little cadence just a little cadence yeah it's a yeah, two Never. bar cadence do it in anything you like just two bars in four by four Anna Anna get ready then you yeah? so while Georgios do it get ready Two bars, four by four, little cadence with postcadential resolution. Let's see. Mm. Iris the same. No, 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 no. Is that okay? Let's see. Is that okay for cadence? Uh, give me the guys first. No, so sol fa mi fa sol fa mi fa mi re mi re si do. But in what bar is it? Uh, six. Sol fa mi fa mi re mi re si do. Yes. Pa do 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 do. Well done. That's it. Yes, it's fine. Now the caseta. Again, all together. Come on, 
more time. It's, it's, get, it's getting there. It's getting there. It's getting there. It's not bad. Come on. Calm down. Relax. Calm down. You need to clarify. <laughs> You're doing too many, you're doing too many triplets. Tanda, sol, fa, mi, fa, mi, re, mi, re, do, re, do, si, do. That's it, that's the case. Sol, fa, mi, fa, mi, re, mi, re, do, re, do, si, do. Yeah, and then. Look, look. First question you need to ask to yourself. Remember that you need to remove the the do crochet, no? So sol fa mi fa mi re mi re do re do si do re mi re do si do re mi re do si do re mi do re mi re do. For example, yeah. Because what is confusing you is that you are stopping in the last note. Due to the structure of your theme, you need to keep on going. Yeah. So. Example, something like that. Yes. There's something there. There's something. When you were starting to liquidate, you exp you make it big, big, bigger again, and then you liquidate it again. Yes, because it's too small. Otherwise, I can't liquidate it. So I need to make it a bit bigger, and then I can liquidate. It. I have no idea what what you're using now. <laughs> I'm trying to understand. Yes. Look, Georgios, you will think about this one, but you will remind me because I forget these kind of things. And you will put it in your reports that you, uh, you need to send me the reports of these lessons. And we will start next lesson with this result. I can make you, if you give me the next week, I can make you a theme on that. But now I'm not sure what, what I'm using. Okay, if that's I fine. If I do this study, I can, I can make something very good, yes. Okay, good, good. For next Friday. That's good. Then... By the way, did you get uh, what I sent you this yes, morning? Yes, yes. But the thing is that I was, I was working on this, on this uh, lesson, actually, because I wanted, to, I wanted to teach you something else today. But uh, Gisela, my friend, colleague, and inspirer for education matters, uh, always tells me that I tend to... Uh, put too many things together in the in the lesson. So that I I desisted from doing that. And so I will do it on, on next Friday. But yes, I was, I'm preparing something for you that is kind of relying on you understanding what we did today. Yeah? So that's why I couldn't see the exercises. Plus, the exercises are for Friday in general because the practical is Friday. Yeah, by definition. I'm not sure what is... Yeah, Sunday mm -hmm. is theoretical always, and Friday is practical. I might do something practical in Sunday, but homework is always from week to week. This was theoretical today. Yeah, today is Kaplan. Is the is the traditional Kaplan? Yeah. Did we not do only practice today? Uh, well, I did practice to teach you the the codetas. Fair yes. Fair Exactly, because I want to make sure that you under I think today you understood what the codeta is. Even if you couldn't do the example, you understood it conceptually. Mm. Yes, although I didn't. I'm not sure what the resources were, the, the, the terms. The I mean. terms, yeah, we were going to review it. So, what we are studying today is the post cadential, the, sorry, the post cadential closing section. That's what we are doing today, a closing section. Yeah, so the closing section has codetas inside, and the codetas work by liquidation. 
Yeah, that's the concept, but there is no better way to understand it if you do it. Okay, so mm. Iris, your turn. Theme and Godeta. Yes, okay. Eh, well, it's not a theme, no? It's a... No, no, Cadence and Godeta. Okay. Eh, in whatever I want? Anything. Okay. Mm. So... Wait, wait. <laughs> For example, that's the thing. I mean, okay. as a, it would be. No, try to finish it in the in the tonic. So if, ah, yes, yes, yeah, okay. because it will be difficult for you otherwise to let's see. Yeah, I mean it was okay. Yes. Again. Okay. So that's better. Again, one more time. Okay. Yes. told me that it's almost here in Spain, 11 in the evening. So I will kind of, yeah, um, if it was for me, I would stay here until 1 a.m. in the morning, like Bruno mm. used to do with, with me in the lessons. I did lessons when it was midnight with Bruno. I started, because he does, he, he goes to sleep in the afternoon, he wakes up at 7 p.m., then he wants to eat, and then he eats and talks with all his, his friends, and then at 11... He's in kind of in the mood of doing something that he doesn't want to. He has procrastinated the entire day. So I remember myself traveling to, if you ask your, your mom, Iris, traveling to Valvanera, that's very difficult, very, um, that is a, in those years, it was a, say, a very dangerous area to go to. So to have a lesson at 11.30 in the morning, in the, in the evening. <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> so, so, so well. Um, we close there. Just bring everything down for uh, Friday. The same thing. So we, I will correct what you sent me for today plus what you sent me for Friday. Okay. Yes. Good Thank you, Juan. See you. Bye, bye, bye. Anna. Bye. I will listen to you in next lesson as well because we can't hear you. Yeah. So we'll be better too. Yeah. Perfect. And I call you tomorrow. Bye, Anna. Bye, bye.